everybody and welcome back again to Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins! So, I have been busy again in between episodes. I have been visiting quite a number of landmarks. As you can see, I finished all of them on this island, including the granary and a few smaller um, landmarks in the vicinity. Um, the only one that I haven't quite finished yet is this one over here. Which is the house of a random person? I mean, apparently there's only a papyrus inside, but um, I feel that I may have to visit this place at some point during some sort of quest, because why would they put this house on the map as like a landmark? I'm sure this will have some relevance later. So I didn't go inside yet, um, and I guess I will sooner or later have to go there anyway. And if not, I will just uh, come back to pick up the papyrus. But yeah, um, I think today I would like to continue with um, that quest about Shadia's parents. After killing the crocodile, Bayek returns to visit his grieving friends Hot Hephaestus and Renut. He finds them bitter and broken and in need of his help. So I think um, we should try to help out these poor people. Also, there's like a little uh, papyrus on top of this viewpoint. And it says, Philadelphia, mound of grain and gold, a pile of shit, if truth be told. Someone apparently doesn't like this place. I mean, it's this one over here, right? I don't know. Looks nice to me. <laughs> but okay, um, let's head over there and let's see how we can help um, Hotefres and Renut. Um, I'm going in the wrong direction, right? Yes, I, I have to go in this direction. <coughs> All right, I'm going to assume this over here uh -huh. is the Philadelphia farm. Yeah. I've seen a Philadelphia granary, but again, it's a restricted area, so I may have to go there later. <gasps> Not too. Um, okay, let's see. A Barnley, there's somewhere on top of here. Also, interesting place. I mean, the architecture is mostly Greek, but then they have some random Egyptian statues in here. <coughs> but I mean, um, the name Hotefres sounds Egyptian to me, but um, he's wearing like Greek clothes, so I guess he's a very Hellenized Egyptian. Hotefres, what is going on? My friend, you came. I am glad. Who is this? Hm? Where is Renut? My wife is wherever she goes, withdrawn and cold. This is uh, yesterday. She was just leaving. You are a pig. I was bored anyway. Thanks for the wine. Okay. Renut is probably down at the lake. I will take you to her. Let me know when you are ready to go. Um, well, it, it seems that um, the loss has taken quite a toll on this relationship because I am going to assume that this is a mistress or former mistress because um, apparently she's already old news. Um, okay, I don't know. Let's talk. Hotifres, what is this? What are you doing? You will lose everything. I know, I know. I am useless to anyone right now. Hmm? Then stop being useless. Be angry. Pick up your sword and start fighting. Well, not everyone can be a fighter. Not everyone can be you, Bayek. Alright, where do we need to go? Oh, do we need to... I hung up my sword years ago. I Horses. only got involved because Apollodorus practically demanded it. He thought us all threatened by some grave conspiracy. Now Shadia's dead. Something big is happening. You were right to try to help. I was stupid. I did not want to do it. Henot insisted, said it was our duty. If I had not listened to her, Shadia would still live. Whoa. Trying to avoid a little mini quest oh, there. She will be up ahead. We built a then shrine we'll have to by wait the water. For another time. Shadia loves the water. We feed the fish before supper. I mean, 
She did. We used to. All right. I guess I will try to talk to her. Is that the shrine over here? Yeah, I think I can see her. Henut, it is good to see you. Henut? Mm. This is how she is now. <laughs> there is something that might help. In Siwa, we have a ritual to mark a loved one's passing. Would you mind? Go ahead. The ritual requires something. I will return shortly. Okay. I should leave them to grieve. What do you need? I need a feather for the ritual. Oh. There are marshlands nearby. I will find birds there. I need a heron feather. Flocks of herons appear near Philadelphia farm. Ah. Okay, um, there's a quest mark over here, so I guess I will go over here to look for a heron. And um, the guided arrow usually works well. Oh, are these herons? Let's see. Oh, well, that, that arrow totally went straight through the bird. Hmm. That was weird. And now all the birds are gone. Oh, well, there's another one. Okay. Okay, this time it worked. So I guess these were fake birds. They were not supposed to be I shot. Need. Okay, but I have the feather. Let's go back to Henut. All right, let's see that ritual. You'll do what you're told, you lazy shit. If you need more grain, grow more. It's not my problem. Oh Captain! No. What's going on now? Cannot. No, we can't. I know you are not extorting grain from this farmer. Because you know that would be violating several Egyptian <laughs> laws. As officials of Fayum, we both know it. Don't we? I will see you soon. <laughs> Official. Well, at least he's still, like, standing up for her. When she's trying to confront these people. My husband. We must shake off our grief. We cannot let others suffer too. Not when we can stop it. You were a fighter once. It is time to fight again. You see yourself the corruption. There is no one to protect the people. This is not over. Apparently not, because now I'm supposed to assassinate the Ptolemy captain of Philadelphia. <coughs> All right, well, I guess um, I will take care of that for you because he's probably going to come back and will try to harm you. Um, so let's try to catch up with him. All right. Um, let's see. Can I hit one of you guys? That thing gets through. Die, die. Okay, let's see if we can lure him into this poppy field, or whatever it is. Oh, what? look ah, at that, Sanuous, ah! coming to help me. <laughs> Alright, but now I, I, gotta, I gotta fight them. Let's do it. Let's start with the smaller ones, because that's going to give us adrenaline. And then we can use them against the big guy. There we go. That worked quite well. Okay, and apparently we have a few more small soldiers over here. Let's 
Put them down and I hope that's going to be it. At least I hope that we won't attract more soldiers. Okay. I was a little bit worried that those... Oh, well, we may yeah, actually have attracted a few more. That's always a problem with soldiers. If you kill like one or two of them, ten more arrive. Alright, I hope the fire is going to kill you now. You will not escape! Okay. That arrow did the trick. And this is just a rebel. Okay. I think I think we got all of them now. Um, I mean there might be more somewhere in the distance. Yeah, those over there. But um they're not my concern at the moment. Um but I still gotta confirm the kill. Yes I do. An insignia. I do not recognize this. Hmm. Maybe Hotefres knows more. He will not be missed. But he spoke of a commander. Someone else is giving the orders. This is not over. Yeah, it's some kind of lizard, huh? Alright, let's let's go back to Hotefres and let's discuss what we wanna do about this. You live! <laughs> They'd marked Henut for death. Death found them fast. Indeed. I envy them. Well, it had to be done. <laughs> These soldiers do not seem to understand anything else. There's more. The captain was under orders. I found this insignia on him. Do you know it? Yes. This is not good. It is from Fort Bubastos to the east. Run by another Malakia who thinks himself untouchable. Henut was right. Hmm. People will continue to suffer unless we act. Bayek, I am sorry to ask this. We need your help. You have it. There's something I must do fast, though. I will return soon. Okay. So, what do you want to do? Oh, right, the ritual. I almost forgot about that. <laughs> That's what we came here to do. So apparently that feather stuff is like a sea wind ritual. All right. Shadia, my lotus. No other will suffer as you did. I swear it. Goodbye, my little tadpole. Swim forever free. <laughs> All right, I hope. This is going to help her a little bit. <laughs> Not sure how, but it's the least we can do. Okay, um, that finishes this quest, but surely there's got to be a follow-up to this, because, yeah, there we go. Fighting for Fayum. Um, let's have a look at that quest. Um, suggested level 30. Okay, so shouldn't be a problem. A corrupt Ptolemy commander at nearby Fort Bubastus is extorting grain from Fayum's farmers. Bayek must convince the farmers to help him end the corruption. Oh, well, that's interesting. I'm not going to do it all on my own. I'm trying to rally the people. Um, sure. I guess I'm just going to continue with this right away. Because um, I would like to finish at least the most important stuff in this area before I return all the way to the north. So let's uh, talk to Hotefres again and see how we want to do this. Who's, who's that other person? Are there like two Henuts now? <laughs> it it kind of looks like there's two Henuts. Um... um Mysterious duplication of wife. 
<laughs> Look at that. Okay, um, let's let's go and talk to Hot Ephraim. It is true. The soldiers were only the beginning. <laughs> we have to deal with this commander. We need more information. How far does the corruption go? It may rise as far as Ptolemy's inner circle. We cannot trust any Falakitai. We cannot do it alone. We need Fayum. Most of the farmers will not talk for fear of the soldiers. But they are angry. It will not take much to convince them. Let me talk to that farmer the captain was threatening. I will spread the word. <laughs> okay, apparently the one on the left is the actual Henut, and um, this one is just a glitch. Well, congratulations, Hotefres. You have two wives now. <laughs> I hope you're happy. <laughs> Which is actually something that is rather uncommon in ancient Egypt. Most of the marriages were monogamous. And only the pharaoh, you know, he had multiple wives. But normal people usually only had one. But okay, let's go and talk to the farmer. And see if we can gain a few supporters. Uh. Can I talk to you, please, good sir? Seni, I saw what happened with the soldiers. Nebet Khenu took a big risk. I appreciate what she did, but it won't change anything. I'm sorry, but I must keep working. I've got a stack of fires to light. Let me help then. Hmm. Burn the pies for the farmer. All right. I mean, I could just shoot them with a flaming arrow. Or am I supposed to use my uh, torch? What are you doing? Lighting your fires. <laughs> you don't give up, do you? Ra will ensure your crops are fertile, Seni. Okay, well, using the bow is actually slightly faster, I suppose. And I don't have to move. Okay, there we go. It's all lit. There you are. It is time to rise up against the soldiers. <laughs> Hotefres will fight with you. Hotefres? He abandoned us long ago. His father was a good man. He gave his son an Egyptian name. We loved him for that. But he could not give him an Egyptian heart. Hotefres means satisfied in our tongue. But he never was. He soon left us to the hyenas and crocodiles. Yet crocodiles may still be defeated. The captain is no more. Rise, Seni. Spread the word. You defeated the captain? Wow. You are a madman. Okay. If you are willing to do this, I will join you. I will spread the word, Seni. All right. Persuasion 101. Just burn a few pyres of hay and they're going to follow you. Okay, speak to Hot Efres at the Philadelphia farm. So we have one farmer, but I hope that he's going to bring um, his friends. So we can do this. Let's go back and talk to Hot Efres. So he mentioned that Hot Efres father gave him an Egyptian name. So I'm guessing the father might have been Greek, maybe the mother Egyptian or something. And I mean, he does dress like Greek. So I guess he's like of both cultures in a way. I did not know things were this bad. I mean, I knew there was trouble, just not like this. This is my fault. I did not want the responsibility here in Fayum. The inheritance was forced on me. I wanted to stay on my ship, the adventure. Now, I realize. Giving up is a choice. And I am still alive. They must be in the villa. Take the back. You, uh -oh. come with me. Uh-oh. Soldiers! They're actually taking the first initiative here. Where huh? are you, Malakia? Come down. We need a talk. Looks like the choice has been made for me. All right. Come, brother. Let us talk to them. We gotta with our swords. take care of these guys. I have got your back. And it is good yep. to have you back, brother. 
Those was a pretty neat series of shots. But I need one more. There we go. All headshots. Hey, you fight well for someone retired. <laughs> <laughs> I am not old yet, C1. I can see that. But it will not be enough. The soldiers will come in greater numbers now. I inherited more than a strong sword arm. I will hire a private army if I need to. I might have a better idea. Bayek, could you accompany me on a short journey? Surely. What do you have in mind? Follow Henut. Um, can I loot these bastards over here? Yes, I can. All right, let's go. I'm ready. Let's go. You two make a good team. Hotefres has lost none of his fire. You sound proud of him. <laughs> it is nice to have back the man I married. <laughs> so maybe I can even save their marriage here. There is a rebel camp nearby. It is to the east of here, by Fort Bubastos. We are going to meet with them. Rebels? We're dealing with them, not Andy Raff of Alexandria. Alexandria is no stranger to intrigue, Magi. Favors are sometimes traded for information or protection. Such alliances are necessary if not officially acknowledged. All right. I can get behind that. Let's talk to the rebels. We could certainly use some support here. I can't headshoot every single soldier in this area. Whoa. Oh, I think we kind of destroyed that carriage. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I haven't Enough been there. in this area yet. Yep, we're going into the next gnome. Neat. Ooh, um... This way. Their camp is just up ahead. That was a very abrupt corner. <laughs> yeah. We should be cautious. Rebels are not known for their hospitality. I sent word. They are expecting us. Very good. I am Henut. I sent word from Philadelphia that we were coming. We need your help. You wasted your time. Sorry, we cannot help you. We are not asking for charity. <laughs> we can offer food, supplies, and information. All we require in return is protection for our people. I said we cannot help. Soldiers captured our leader down at the dam. Then perhaps we can help you. This is Bayek of Siwa. You are Bayek of Siwa? We were told what you did at the arena. Beating the Gallic brothers like a madman. And I suppose today My reputation I play the me. madman again. <laughs> okay, so winning that arena fight apparently gave us quite the reputation. And it's going to come in handy now. Rescue the leader of the Fayum rebels. Right, I'm going to free your leader and then you will help me... Um, drive away all these soldiers, right? Uh, let's have a look. It's somewhere over here. Also, I gotta be a little bit careful because there's a lucky die roaming the area as well. Um, I mean, he is below my level. So, again, if I find a good high spot, I might be able to just take him out with my arrows. But you never know. You never know if I can find such a spot. So, let's just head over our destination here and for now let's try to avoid um, that for lucky tie maybe we will deal with him in the next episode let's focus on our mission now all right there's some restricted area over here we gotta avoid that one too Okay, um, I'm going yeah, to assume yeah, your yeah. leader is being held Goodness. captive Some awesome soup. in this <laughs> fort over here. Cleon's Dam. Alright. It does look large. But I think it's mostly water. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really just a dam. It's not a fort. Okay, well, um... This is this is something new. 
Um, okay, my target is over here, but I will probably have to kill most of these soldiers if I want to get him out of here. I don't know, I may have to carry him or whatever, so... Yeah. Um, and he's far away, so I hope he's not going to be a problem. And I mean, if these people over here notice me, these people over here are not like going to use a signal fire, right? These are like separate installations. <laughs> At least I hope so. Um, they do have a signal fire too, though, as I just noticed. So, <laughs> okay, okay. Um, let's see. What would be the best way to infiltrate this place? All right. This a guy on top of this wall. This place is heavily guarded. Let's quickly take him out. I mean, actually might be able to just get him out of here without taking over the entire place. Go now. Thank uh -oh. you. He's kind of are you to attack so running in a so bed in a bed Don't you fear direction though. I am Baik of Siwa and I am more afraid of Egypt sleeping. The crazy Siwan. My men spoke of you. Fighting in the arena single-handed like a madman. <laughs> Nick! They told me dogs have no chance if you're on our side. And I will need you on my side when it matters. Okay, it, it looks like he's not going to follow me, but he may want to walk his own we should move. path. Let us go. So freeing him from his shackles before we cleaned out this place may have been a mistake. Oh, and now we have Philakis in the vicinity as well. I'll cut you, dog. That's just great. Um... I'll start the blaze! The prize is mine! Yeah, this... This was not such a great idea. Let's wait for... Less for Lucky Tai to, to leave die. again. I mean, as far as I understand, he can't actually die, right? Man. If he's like important for the quest, the has come for you. they're not going to kill you him. Die. Climb under a rock, have you? Timid son All of right, a now let's see if I can assassinate him. There we go. Now let's get out of here. Oh, um, the for Lucky Tai is very close though. I will I will try to stay away from him. We should hurry. Yes, I'm I'm trying to avoid like a very, very dangerous enemy over here. Can you maybe just follow my lead? <laughs> uh, this is this is all rather unfortunate, but it looks like There is not time to waste. He's he's going into that other fort, so maybe I will be able to uh, bring back the leader to wherever he is trying to go. Okay, now why why didn't you just follow me? This is exactly the way that I just went myself. <laughs> okay, the way back from I made here it. Is clear. Before you go, I need a favor. Henut is waiting at your camp. <clears throat> she will ask for your help to protect her people. I owe you my life. You have my word, it will be done. Could you also tell her I go to Fort Bubastos? I have business with the commander there. Alone against a fortified garrison? <laughs> Are you crazy? I am. Perhaps. I am Bayek of Siwa. I am the madman of the arena. Okay, there we go. And yeah, I should have I should have trusted my instincts not to free the prisoner before I actually killed all the soldiers. I mean, it worked out in the end, but it was kind of close. Um, ooh, ooh, what's what's going on here? Is this like an animal lair? A vulture lair? There's like a lot of vultures, so probably there doesn't seem to be one though. Um, I mean, we still have some time left in this episode, so maybe I will actually give this a try. 
Um, I hope that the Folaketa is going to stay in that camp for a while so I can deal with the fort. Again, I only need to assassinate the uh, commander, so maybe I will not actually try to you know, clean out the entire place this time, but just finish the rest off camera. Um, and instead I will just try to find the quickest way towards my target. And I mean, if the Falakitai were to come, this actually might not be the worst place to ambush him. I don't think he can climb up these high cliffs. Okay, um, yeah, this is a big place. But since it's starting to get night, um, this may actually work in my favor. Okay, I'm not going to go through here, I think. Maybe I can climb up um, the mountains and then infiltrate directly towards my, my target. <coughs> Alright, let's do it. I hope I can climb up here anyway, but I mean, Bayek has always, you know, exceeded my expectations when it came to climbing skills, so I don't see why he shouldn't be able to do this. Okay, um, it looks like um, the way to the commander is actually not that difficult. He's I inside. Not be seen in this area. This little building, there are a lot of guards in the area. But I'm also seeing like a rope connecting uh, the outer uh, walls and that place. Um, but I definitely have to take care of some of the soldiers, specifically the ones on the battlements and the towers. Alright. Let's see what we can do here. Um, well, these soldiers actually might not be on the tower. I mean, they always have these watchtowers, but very often there's no soldier on them. That's not why you need watchtowers, if you're not going to put anyone on them. Alright. That apparently is our target. Um, well, do I need any ammo? No, I do not. So, I may want to make use of that rope over there after all. <coughs> Probably the best way to get closer <coughs> to my destination. But yeah, this seems like a huge strategic mistake. Uh oh. Horns. Oh. Voices. Someone else is attacking the fort. It seems well, all of Fayum has turned against the commander. That is not what I was expecting. But I can totally work with that. Okay, let's see if we can use a guided arrow. Kill. Ah, it's it's very difficult to actually get close to him, but I might be able to assassinate him like this. There we go. That is the end of his corruption. Indeed. I should meet the others. Now let's um, help out these guys by killing some of the soldiers. And I guess I will just leave because it looks like the rebels are going to. Take care of this, huh? Alright. Let's get out of here. That was certainly not uh, the development that I expected. <laughs> but yeah, um... There's a lot of stuff going on. I will, I will go back to that camp and um, make sure to kill all the commanders and pick up all the treasures. But that would be... A little bit much for this episode because that place is very huge. 
All right, back to Hotafris it is. Oh, you've been watching. <laughs> it is done. You had help. The farmers staged a protest to distract the soldiers. They were fearless. The rebels also did their part. You've inspired them, Bayek. In truth, they are in awe of you. Our farms will be well protected. They love their crazy sea. <laughs> they won't let another crocodile plague the Fayum again. Your people are free now. It is a good start. Otifres, it is time to live up to your name. And my duty as a husband. Shadia liked you immediately, you know. You always have a home here, if you need it. Alright, apparently um, we saved Fayum from the soldiers and we also saved their marriage. Take that. I would call that a win. Um, yeah, there we go. Uh, this quest is finished and I leveled up again. And yes, I have to go back to that camp and clean it out, but that's going to be a little bit longer. And I guess I'm going to do it off camera because, I mean, those um, fort infiltrations usually happen every once in a while as part of a quest. So I don't think I have to do all of that on camera, right? Um, anyway, where exactly am I now? Alright, interestingly enough, the guy that we killed doesn't count towards the captain and commander of this place. So I have to uh, kill two of those again. And where did the Falakitai... Oh, suddenly he's all the way over here. Interesting. Um, now we do have some interesting places in in this vicinity. There's like another pyramid over here, and something unusual over here. So I would like to visit these two viewpoints and see what's going on there. And since we still have a few minutes left in this episode, I guess I will do this on camera. So yeah, I will head over to um, this viewpoint and we will check out this pyramid. I'm not exactly sure what pyramid this is, but I guess um, I will find out. <coughs> All right, well, this pyramid looks to be in a pretty <coughs> poor state oh no oh no i hope i'm not going to die no i did not so i don't know this could be maybe one of the middle kingdom pyramids so one of the late uh pyramids um because they were still building pyramids in the middle kingdom but only very few of them have survived intact because um they weren't built quite as sturdy a lot of them were only built but with bricks and so on, and not stone. Although this does look like it would be stone. Um, let's have a closer look at it. <coughs> but this could be a pyramid that doesn't actually exist anymore today. Yeah, I mean, it looks like they already stripped away a lot of the outer stone and recycled it, presumably. But yeah, let's go all the way to the top and I'm sure it's going to give us some information what pyramid we're looking at here oh boy um, can I actually climb even higher here yes I can all right let's synchronize So, does the map give me any kind of info? No, but there is like a landmark down here. Um, apparently, the landmarks that have a glow are stone circles. So, this might be another stone circle. Let's, let's check it out. I mean, so far I haven't gotten any kind of name for this landmark or... 
place, so... Let's see. Alright, here we go. Tomb of Amenemhat the Third. Okay, so it is one of the Middle Kingdom pyramids. And yeah, I do believe that this one is still partially standing, but it barely looks like a pyramid anymore. Um, and yeah, this uh, landmark over here, I feel that um, from from its aerial view, it kind of looks a little bit like the uh, Temple of Hatshepsut, but that one should be way down in the south, so I don't think this is it. Even with Assassin's Creed's rather compressed... Um, distances between different places this shouldn't be here although it kind of looks like it you know the various um, terraces that form that temple but um, like I said I, I don't think this is it that shouldn't be that far to the north but yeah um, I guess um, I will explore the tomb of Amenemhat in the next episode and then I will check out um, that other landmark as well so Hopefully we can find out what exactly it is. It's some kind of temple, um, but I would be very surprised if it's actually the temple of Queen Hatshepsut, or well, Pharaoh Hatshepsut to be precise. Which is a pity, because um, I would really like to see the temple. It is very unique. But yeah, I think for now we're going to call it a day as usual. Thank you for watching and see you again next time.